410 John Allen Tribute Locomotive. Using the white classification system, the 410 was not a popular locomotive type in North America. In fact, there was only one built in 1883 named El Gubernador. The largest steam locomotive in the world at that time, it was not successful because 19th century boiler technology could not provide enough steam for its large cylinders. Hence the 410 is often omitted entirely in later white locomotive classification lists. Then in the early 1950s, a totally freelance 410 design appeared in some of John Allen's magazine articles about his gory and defeated model railroad. The Grand Poobah, as he was sometimes called, would often create whimsical items for his layout. Perhaps the most outrageous was the, quote, organic switcher number 13, a stegosaurus named Emma. So in perspective, the 410 number 34 was not much of a stretch. I decided a long time ago that I would like to build a 410 patterned after Gorian Defeated's number 34. So I started slowly gathering model information. Most helpful was Andy Sperandio, I apologize if I mispronounced your last name, who, just before retiring as editor of the Model Railroader magazine, arranged for me to receive an entire photo session of the model as it looks today after surviving the fire which destroyed most of John's model railroad in 1973. I learned that number 34 was made from a die-cast Varney Redding 280 boiler, Mantua 50-inch drivers, Varney Casey Jones cylinders, and a scratch-built tender. Indeed, I even found on the internet that some folks were following that recipe and had projects under construction as you see here. Now I prefer to work in brass and have kit bashed or brass bashed a number of locos for my collection. So I secured some basket cases on eBay as my donor locos. A gem Redding 280 for the superstructure and a PFM Russian decapod for the drivetrain. Now these are stock photos, not the basket cases I used. So uh, thank you, BrassTrains.com. I was lucky to have a brass tender from a Milwaukee prairie in my brass parts boneyard, which looked much like the original tender on number 34, as seen in the older magazine articles. And here is the result after some model engineering and adding an extra sand dome and piping, putting a Tenshoto Franklin booster truck under the tender, extending the front end to accommodate a four-wheel spoked pilot truck, and replacing the ladders with platforms over the pilot. Since the Gem Donor Loco had a nicely detailed boiler backhead, a smaller motor was installed.
So now, in my collection, the 410O type is not referred to as a Mastodon, but instead a John Allen as a tribute to the Wizard of Monterey.